I'm an artist and uh, I just don't make enough money to, to afford the you know, monthly payments. Right now at 31, Billy Allen worries while he works. He's healthy, but he knows anything could happen. I ride my bike everywhere in the city and so I won't have to, you know, be, I'll still be scared, but I won't be as scared. At the Greenwich House Pottery, where Billy has a studio and teaches, all we had to do was say Obamacare and other artists and students wanted to talk. I hope for uh, more affordable insurance, monthly payments, and maybe better coverage. Michael Benjamin's current health plan is ending, and it hasn't been a bargain. I think I'm paying 320 a month and when I st for uh, insurance that does not cover a lot. Um, when I had, I had it, my appendix out and I wound up with like $10,000 left over in medical bills, even with that insurance. I'm hoping that the Obamacare will offer some subsidies. Michael Anzalone, a freelance costume designer, now struggles to pay his insurance. I've lived with no coverage, I got freelancers, and I'm still struggling to pay $450 a month for health insurance. Interestingly, they all feel something like pioneers. I'm going to sign up immediately on October 1st. In some ways I feel like a sense of patriotism to enroll and hopefully build a strong, you know, system of people in a, in a common coverage. Barbara Nevins-Taylor, ConsumerMojo.com.